Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial and today it's on Staff Essentials. So this is a really awesome plugin which adds lots of new commands that your staff can use to uh, control the server and check everyone is uh, playing correctly and there's no trouble. So um, to begin with, uh, let's start with a command, sj, which hides the join messages. Pretty straightforward, but you can uh, use that if you want to. Uh, another cool um, command is forward slash sc which is uh, staff chat so you can chat amongst the other staff pops up yellow here so you know that you're not typing to um, the other players a very very cool feature I really like that and obviously I can type normally again to the uh, non-staff members so um, let's move on to some other commands such as staff list uh, pretty straightforward this there's one staff member online and uh, that's who it is so you'd probably want to give this to uh, players, because I know lots of them ask, are there any staff online? And usually the answer is, uh, if they get an answer, no. So they can check that way. Um, and that doesn't actually require a permission, which is uh, pretty useful. Then if we do forward slash cc, a very useful command, that just clears chat. So um, not only can you clear your own chat, but you can clear someone else's chat uh, if, they, if they ask for it for some reason. Uh, which is a very cool command. And then we move on to the staff log command. So if we go staff log ltgym, this looks at all the commands that we've typed that are set in the config. So at the moment, every command that I type that involves op or home will be logged here and the time. If I type forward slash message, for example, and then forward slash op, it will only um, log the op that I typed, which was uh, just now, this one. So that's really, really cool. Uh, you might want to add world edit commands to that and forward slash TNT. So if any staff member goes rogue, you can find out who it is and ban them good and proper. So uh, that's a really, really cool command. And obviously, um, you can clear a player's um, chat log if, if you wanted to. Like that. Uh, next, we are going to move on to the report command. So this is a really cool feature. Um, probably best that only admins have it I wouldn't want to give it to other players so you, what you can do you can report a particular player for a reason um, lots of griefing you can write a string here hit enter and that will be created as a report um, so when I joined it says there are currently two reports open so if I re rejoined um, there would be three so we can have a look at the reports by doing staff report and uh, then list and uh, this shows the reporter, why they reported it, and who they're reporting. So uh, I've reported myself three times, and you can see the reasons there. Uh, pretty cool feature. And obviously you can um, close a report by doing this, and then the ID, which is one, one again, and obviously one again. There will be no more reports left. Um, so yeah, no more reports, which is um, a very nice feature. You can also announce stuff using the staff alert message, so um, something is happening, but what? So that pops up there, just above the hotbar and in chat, very very nice, I really like the um, prefix, looks pretty nice. And there is uh, one more command, well technically two, you can freeze players and then unfreeze them if they are running about being hooligans because you don't want that and obviously in the config you can uh, edit a bit of text and some other things and use a MySQL database if you really want to I wouldn't suggest that but uh, yeah overall I think that is all the commands yes yes it is um, pretty cool plugin uh, definitely recommended it and yeah I believe it's up to date for 1.8 subscribe like comment and I'll see you next time